Hey everyone, I have a quick word to share today. And today's word is power shift. It's all you. Power shift. It's all you. And this word isn't for everybody. So please take it to the Lord for confirmation and always test the spirit behind every prophetic word, including mine. But if this message is for you, there's a power shift going on in this hour. And for many of you, you have shut the devil down. You have submitted yourself to Jesus Christ. You're walking in the spirit. You're walking in holy fire. You're walking in dominion. And the enemy no longer has a hold on you. And this is the power shift. And it's all you because you have made the choice to submit yourself to the authority of Jesus Christ. We all have free will. We all have a choice to make in this life. And you made the right call. You made the right choice. And now it's all in your favor. The power is in your hands. And it's not even because of you. It's because you are submitted to the Lord. You are walking in holy fire. You're walking in dominion. You're no longer a slave to sin. You're no longer giving the enemy legal rights to you through willful sin in your life. And so just continue to move forward, you know, blameless in front of the Lord. You've had your, your righteous robes on. I'm having a vision of someone being crowned. The Lord is setting a crown upon your head in this hour. And it's, he's exalting you. He's crowning you because you have humbled yourself. You have a humble spirit. It's not, about, you know it's not about you. You know that you're not that good. <clears throat> and because of this, it's all falling on you in this hour. The Lord has chosen you for such a time as this because you're the type of person who doesn't seek the attention. You don't seek the spotlight. You don't, you know, you don't want to be, uh, you know, in the, in the limelight, you're comfortable being behind the scenes. And it's for this very reason that it's all falling on you in this hour. The Lord is raising up his remnant, his next generation of soldiers for Christ. And we're rebuilding the temple one soul at a time on this earth. The Lord has raised you up to help course correct the church. You know, there's no other way to put it. Many of you have been cast out of the church because that unclean spirit in the church could not handle the holy fire that you're walking in. You know, unfortunately, we've gotten to the point where many of our churches are run by Jezebel. They're run by Ichabod. They're run by the religious spirit. And the Lord is done. And that's why he called you to start a YouTube channel. Or he called you to start a ministry. Or he called you into entrepreneurship, into the marketplace. Because he's raising up his true foot soldiers in his army, those who are not self-seeking, those who are vessels completely submitted to the Lord, who aren't afraid to speak the truth of love, who are willing to be persecuted for standing up for what's right, for standing up for the Holy Spirit and, and not afraid to shut down the religious spirit. You know, you're, many of you are like John the Baptist. <laughs> you know, you uh, aren't afraid to call out the brood of vipers when they come for you. You know, you don't mince words. And it's, it's not out of a, a mean spirit. It's out of a righteous spirit in the name of Jesus. You know, listen. John the Baptist wasn't afraid to call out that religious spirit. And for many of you, the Lord is using you mightily in the same way in this season. And this is also a power shift in the church. This is a changing of the guard because many of those who've gotten into leadership positions, who are have built platforms, it's, it's become all about them. They're no longer um, seeking first the kingdom of God and its righteousness. They're self-seeking selfish selfish ambition so the lord is raising up people who are putting him first and um that's part of this power shift it's actually a shift back to the lord you know from people who are self-seeking who are taking advantage of people they're taking advantage of their position and taking advantage of the people around them because of whatever um wealth or fame they've gained on the back of the Lord, you know, claiming to be um, 
speaking for the Lord, but they've been corrupted. And so for many of you, you're part of this power shift and the Lord has tapped you on the shoulder and you've accepted the call. And it's, you know, precisely because of all of these reasons that, you know, you don't want, you're not self-seeking. You don't want to be in the limelight or the spotlight. That's precisely why the Lord is pushing you in the front of the line, why he's putting the spotlight on you in this hour, because it's time. It's time. You know, we, there's a shift going on in the spiritual realm and the Lord is raising up his true remnant. Those who are just completely sold out for the Lord, who are all in on red, the blood of Jesus, who are, um, who've lost their lives in him, who are willing to give up everything, uh, even their lives, you know, for the blood of Jesus, for spreading the gospel on this earth. And so if this message is for you, you're one of those people. And it says in Luke 10, 19, he gives us the authority to trample the enemy like serpents and scorpions under our feet. So you're walking in that authority in this season and the enemy will not prevail against you. It doesn't matter what uh, voice rises up against you. Wep no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Um, that's Isaiah 54, 17. You will silence every voice raised up to accuse you. These benefits are enjoyed by the servants of the Lord. Their vindication will come from me. I, the Lord, have spoken. So don't worry about this religious spirit that, that speaks up against you. The Lord is elevating you. Psalm 75, 7. He alone judges. He decides who will rise and who will fall. And you are the one of the ones who he's shifting that power to because again you don't revel in that you defer it all back to the lord you don't make one move without consulting the holy spirit first and because of this you are in his authority and you're being blessed for it uh the other scripture reference daniel 12 3 those who are wise will shine as bright as the sky and those who lead many to righteousness will shine like the stars forever. So you are shining so bright in this season. You are, you've asked the Lord for wisdom. You prayed for wisdom and the Lord gave it to you uh, and he's making your name great as well. <laughs> and you are leading many to righteousness and whatever it is, the Lord has called you to do. And because of this, you will shine like the stars forever in the name of Jesus. So I don't know who this message is for today, but if this messages for you get in the comments come into agreement with this word and just write power shift power shift and um you know come under the authority of jesus christ just you know walk in holy fire walk in your dominion and know that the lord is using you mightily in this season so if you feel the holy spirit leading you to sow into this message i encourage you to do so i pray over every seed that the lord would increase it a thousandfold i pray for all of you who receive these messages that the right people receive them at the right time i pray the lord continue to go before you follow behind you leading you into his perfect will for your lives if you guys are interested in joining us on Wednesday nights for our Wednesday night uh, members only Bible study and live prophetic flow, that's a live stream every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Eastern time for members only. Just click the join button. It'll show you how you can join. It's a $20 uh, monthly seed that will give you immediate access to all Wednesday night live streaming events and all the previous 42 episodes as of right now. There's 42 if you're watching this in the future, there'll probably there will be more. So go check that out. Big shout out to hashtag Team Jesus. You guys are always um, showing up and showing out in your support. All of my financial partners, all of you guys who pray for me, I could not do this without you. I appreciate each and every one of you so much. All of my new subscribers, welcome to the family. If you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. And just know that when you engage with this content, when you support this channel, you're really helping that content get into that YouTube algorithm, making sure the right people receive these messages at the right time. So huge shout out to 
to all of my subscribers, all of you who support the content. If you're interested in real estate in the Dominican Republic, go to my website, also linked in the description, covenantrealtydr.com. Click on the tour tab if you're interested in coming down to Punta Cana in May to meet me, learn about the buying process and the DR. We also do a missions day. So go to my website, click on the tour tab for more info, and you can reach out to my sales agent, Nikel, with any questions that you might have about real estate in general in the Dominican Republic. Maybe the Lord's calling you out of your native country. Maybe he's calling you to buy an investment property. There's no short-term rental restrictions down there. The price points, we have price points under $100,000, you guys. So if that's something you're interested in, go to my website and check it out. If you're on the social media platforms, I've got all of mine linked in the description. I'd love to connect with you on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and X. Just click on the description and I've got them all linked so you can um, connect with me on those platforms as well. And just know that I love you all so much with the love of Christ and stay blessed.